video, the influx of streaming options has definitely not alleviated brand safety and fraud concerns. And so I believe that advertisers will continue purchasing CTV either directly from publishers or suppliers who are directly connected to premium inventory. I think that advertisers are also relying more heavily on CTV as an alternative to mobile advertising due to the IDFA changes that rolled out last year. Since CTV buying doesn't actually rely on cookies, advertisers can still lean on contextual targeting as well as first party identifiers to hit their target audience. I think that there will be a continued programmatic adoption in CTV, especially in regards to signaling and accurate measurement, because I do know that those have been ongoing challenges within the programmatic space. Publishers who don't have CTV inventory, if they haven't already, will find alternative ways to increase their video supply, whether it be through investing in more video production or carving out new supply for video units such as outstream, vertical, or even high impact video. Marketers have historically used linear TV for upper funnel branding campaigns. However, CTV allows marketers to go deeper with their target audience, offering things like interactive formats where the viewer can be served a call to action. In addition to be highly, being highly measurable, it also opens up more opportunities for marketers to leverage CTV for full funnel marketing campaigns. So really think of this as an opportunity to be served an ad for a great new pair of jeans, and then being able to click on that ad through your television to purchase them right there on your TV. Frequency capping has been an ongoing challenge that CTV marketers and tech providers are trying to solve for. We should see the push for more enriched ad request signals sent to buyers who can make informed decisions about the ads that they then send to users. Along with ad potting and improved ad server decisioning, we should see fewer instances of duplicative commercials or ads running again and again.